Hey, hey, hey there, Middle, Middle Tennessee. So I need to record this mini boot camp that I've been talking about. I want to do this live somewhere in Bedford County, Tennessee, preferably in Shubaville, somewhere around Independence Day. I'm currently looking for a venue, but I need to know how many people are interested in attending. If you would like to join me for this in-person boot camp, please fill out the form at the website. Follow the link below. I will keep you informed as to the time and location of the event. This is not registering for the event, just to be kept up to date. You'll also be the first to be invited to register for the event. If you have any questions or suggestions, just leave me a message when you sign up. I'm looking forward to it. Oh, yeah, let's get back to this message here. Our country is in trouble. Are you ready to do something to help? The goal of this mini boot camp is not simply to introduce you to the Constitution Study Patriots, but for you to leave with the tools you can use to defend and assert your rights. I want you to have the tools and confidence to not only look a government actor in the eye and say no, but the proof that you are right and they are wrong. To do this, we need to do a few things. Now, over the years, as I've read and studied the Constitution, I'm frequently amazed by how little I was taught about it in school. I'm also amazed by how little the American people know about this important document. The part that really breaks my heart, though, is how many people misunderstand not only the Constitution of the United States, but the government it created and the rights it was designed to protect. The goal of this mini boot camp is to provide you both the foundation and the tools you need to start defending and asserting your rights. You won't walk away with a comprehensive knowledge of the Constitution, but you will have the tools to stand up to the tyranny of government actors while you expand your knowledge. Now, in the Gospels, Jesus told the story of two men who built houses. One built his house upon the rock, the other upon the sand. When the storms rose and the winds blew, the house built upon the rock stood, while the house built upon the sand fell. It's the same with defending your rights. There will always be storms. The storms of government actors, bureaucrats, and officials will pound against you when you stand up to them. There will always be those who disagree, and the winds of their arguments can become as strong as a hurricane. If your position is built upon a solid foundation, that just like the house built upon the rock, you will be able to stand in the storm. However, if you are staking your rights on the sands of opinion and common knowledge, then great will be your fall. So the first thing we have to do is build a good and solid foundation. I was born and raised in the Northeast where winters are cold and storms blow every year. Because of this, we build houses upon sturdy foundations. Now I live in the South where summers are hot and the thunderstorms are fierce. Here, we build our houses on shorter foundation, a slab of man-made rock called concrete. Both of these foundations have one thing in common. They hold up the weight and support the building. At the mini boot camp, I will instruct and help you build a strong foundation for the defense of your rights. This foundation will be built on the footings that I have used to defend my rights and the rights of my family. This foundation will not only support the defense of your rights, but help you as you walk your way through this maelstrom we call life. Once you've constructed your foundation, you will have a strong place to anchor the defense of your rights. Now it's time to start building upon it. Now, there are plenty of issues and concerns that you may wish to strike out against, but without some basic tools, how will you build your own security? Over the years of my study and work with the Constitution of the United States, I've discovered there are a few key points that have become the, the starting place for every issue I debate, article I write, or policy I support. At this mini boot camp, I will share them with you. Think of the Constitution as one of those shiny tool sets, you know, the ones that have dozens of different tools. Usually, out of the dozens of tools, there are a few that you use most often. Whether it's your favorite hammer or socket wrench, you go back to these time and time again. When it comes to defending your rights, there are a few key tools that will not only help you defend your rights against the most vicious of arguments, but help you learn to use the rest of the tools in the Constitution as well. What can you expect once you finish the mini boot camp? Well, first, you'll have a solid foundation upon which to build both your knowledge of the Constitution and defend your rights. Several tools to defend your rights, to prove that what you are doing is right, and show the consequences any government actor can expect should they proceed with infringing on your rights. A handout you can use to help you prove your point. An invitation to join one or more of the Constitution Study Patriot groups. You can join the, the Constitution Scholars, the Committees of Correspondence, 
or the Minutemen. Regardless of how you proceed, regardless of what other groups you're a part of, this mini boot camp will give you the starting, just like a military boot camp, it'll give you the basic training you need to be a constitutionally sound patriot.